All right, guys, so we just got home from the doctor. As many of y'all know, I had a doctor's appointment today and do all the blood work and all that. Well, we got some good news. Nothing bad come back. So uh, we'll kind of go in a little bit of that here in just a minute. But right now, I've got a situation going on that one of the babies that was born last night isn't doing well. So one of the babies that was born last night isn't doing well and um, we're fixing to see if we can do something with him. Yeah, he's still breathing. So what we're going to do is I'm gonna go ahead and cut this off and then I'm gonna get mama over here and then I'm going to milk a little bit. This is already washed off. I gotta get mama milked a little bit and then we will put um, some milk down her. Hopefully that's the problem. So this is the mama. And what I'm gonna do is basically just kind of hold mama here. Hopefully this will work like I want. Yeah, she's producing milk. I got a little bit of milk, so I'm gonna draw it up. All right, so, all right guys, so what I'm doing right now is, um, the baby don't have much energy, but as I was getting the milk out of mama, mama didn't seem like she was producing very much milk. Which, baby's drinking it now. This hopefully, hopefully we caught it in time. Now there's another baby somewhere that is this in sibling. She's still breathing, or he is. And right now this is still the claustrum, which is very, very important to these babies. Now, the very first year we went through this, um, we had to learn a lot the hard way, but we, we, we're getting better each year. It's okay, baby. Come on, get out there. There you go. There you go. Just stay right there. Get you some of that. I'm waiting for my partner to get home. She's in town right now. I just got back from the doctor's office and we'll kind of go into that here in a minute. Um, I'm just trying to do what I can to see if I can get some of this colostrum down this baby and maybe we can, we can uh, save it. See, last year when we went through this, I didn't have these little syringes, so. Let it go. Yeah. Where's uh, that yellow one? It was doing good this morning. No, it? we're gonna steal her milk. Because oh. that, that's the important stuff. That's fine. I just want the classroom. If we had to bottle feed it, we had to bottle feed it. Is um, we're going to be stealing this one's milk because she actually gave birth at the same time as she did last night, and she looks like she's pulling. She's got a lot of milk. We'll see. All right, we'll try this. Enough. Yeah, for now. Uh, well, I guess Dixie's just a, she's an amazing guard dog. That's what you call a good guard dog, livestock guardian dog right there. She takes care of all the animals and feeds them and yeah, she did good. She was feeding it. All right guys, so um, this little black and white goat has came a long ways um, from earlier. Um, you know, he wasn't even moving when we first, uh, when I first picked him up, he was lifeless. And he's also got uh, some red in his eye. But one thing that uh, we didn't realize is mother um, didn't produce the milk like she um, should have. So we're gonna try to put this bottle in its mouth 
and try to. I know, baby. Well, come here. We're gonna get you some of this. So I did all of it with the syringe earlier, and um, forced it down him. Made him, you know, definitely come back. Um, he's got some energy, so hopefully we can save these babies. You done for a little bit? Hmm? Time to get brother. All right, tell these guys, hello. Yeah, and I know a lot of people are gonna say, well, why do you got ear tags on them? Because we have so many goats, we gotta keep them separate. There you go, baby. All right. Come here, open up. Come on, you want a drink? He's not hungry right now, so. He ate a lot from that mama, though. Yeah. But anyways, guys, that is absolutely awesome. Look at that baby. From lifeless to up and going. All right, guys. Kaysen just got home from school. From Impact. Where's that baby at? What one? Oh, there it is. All right, Kaysen just got home from school. We're going to go up and check the, the his chickens. And uh, we didn't get to do much today. Like I told you, I had a doctor's appointment. And um, like I say, all the results come back. They did uh, all the tests. All my labs come back good. So I think um, a lot of it's gonna be stress and a pulled muscle. That don't look like they're not. There's oh, one. No, oh, there's one egg, huh? Sure enough. I can't we tell there anymore. We better go in there and get that one egg. Oh, he's turn. They're stepping on it. Yeah. When you hurry. You better hurry. Yeah. All right, go then, in there. They're stepping on it. Kason's gonna get that one egg. There's a hole in it. Huh? There's a hole in There's it. There's a hole in it. Oh, never mind. The, oh, the warm. Oh, it's warm. Yes, I can feel it. Oh, they just laid it, didn't they? Yeah. Sure did. It is. They never checked there anymore. Cause there, there are a lot of hay. You can't even tell. Yeah, we'll have to get them a nesting box. Yeah, we need to spread the st stuff around. All right, let's go check the other ones. That that one is warm. Well, boys and girls, he's not lying. It is really, really warm. Um, we need to wire that up so um, the chickens don't get out. Here, cause. Daddy's going to fix some gates tomorrow. I, like I said, I was at the doctor today and all my results and stuff come back and everything's good. So we're just going to monitor and take care of um, some acid reflex stuff and hopefully um, we can uh, get a control of everything. So Kaysen's opening that and let me put this over here. We're going to get some waters and stuff. What is that, fake? Yeah. Yep. Fake. Yeah, we don't want to hit them. We should be able to tell if they're fake. Yeah, that's fake. 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 Doggone it. But we only got one. We only got one so far. We've got two more cages to check. Yeah, I bet there is eggs in there. All right. See, see we got their food out there, son? See how we got their food? Yeah. And then we got, um, if you look, we got their food we got some laying pellets. We got some oyster shell. I and, saw those. Yeah, some oyster shells too. Hey, one, one, huh? one, on the ground. Oh, it's on the ground though, ain't it? Doggone it. We get, need to make them lay in that box, huh? Yeah. Better uh, get in there and see. Bass, where, where you get, uh, let them pack it. Go better go. I think they can't pack it. Yeah, we want to get in there before they attack it. I sure hope they start using that nesting box. You know it? We don't know. Don't use it. Huh? Cold. It's cold. That's Time. okay. Fake. 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 Okay. Wait, we need to find the extra one. There they go. Yeah, that fake. Even fake. Fake. 
Uh, well, at least we got one egg. Yeah. So we got to go to our next pen. So we got two eggs. We got two eggs so far. Hey, we can't tell. We can't tell that lady. Huh? I, I thought she was laying. Oh, that's a rooster. No, that one. Oh, okay. That hen. Okay. Yeah. I thought you were lean. Um, oh. We're going to go in here. We're going to take a look at the rooster. Uh, we gave the rooster a shot and come back and gave him some more medicine last night. And I got some medicine I'm going to give him tonight too, a, a little bit more B12. And uh, hopefully that'll help him get hope around. He, the, hope there are eggs. Let's, let's hope there's Wait. some eggs in there. Two eggs. No eggs? Fake. 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 Two. Fake. Fake. Well, we got to figure out how we can make them start laying in the nesting boxes. None of them laying in the nesting boxes. I don't know. We'll, we'll have to figure it out. I don't know how we're going to get them to start laying in that nesting box, Hello. but we will see. All right. I'm going to... I'm gonna, I gotta run down here and get some medicine. Uh, go ahead, Kaysen, you go play some ball and I'll go, I'll do the doctoring, okay? How are you doing today, honey? You doing okay? Y'all are some beautiful llamas, you know it? Out here eating that pretty green grass. There's socks. You so pretty. You got a beautiful baby. Yeah, you're so pretty. Yes, well come and tell them hi. Well come here, Princess Leia. Well, come here. Well, tell them hi. You tell them hi? Say hi. Ain't she so pretty, guys? She's beautiful. Yeah. So we're going to keep her because Badger is not her dad. She was, uh, her dad, her dad was from another farm. She was already bred when we picked her up at the auction. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and get some uh, oats out. And uh, I've been mixing them with some B12. And I gotta get some other stuff when we run to town. But uh, we're gonna go through here and uh, put the oats out and kind of go from there. Um, didn't do much video on today. Like I said, went to the doctor. Um, kind of give you all the rundown on it and an update on my medical situation, okay? That pain's always been right there, and um, they've ran every test they could. Um, they've done a CT scan, a CAT scan, that might be the same thing, uh, X-ray CAT scan, uh, didn't do an MRI, but they did a HIDA scan. We ended up taking my gallbladder out, they did a colonoscopy, and then they did a GI scope, and then they did an ultrasound today. So what it's kind of boiling down to is it's going to be um, just basically a pulled muscle um, in my stomach and a little bit of stress, he says. But um, we're gonna monitor it and kind of go from there. Not much more that we can really do. The blood work, everything looks good. So um, praise God for that. Um, I'm just thankful everything looked good on, on the results. And uh, yeah, we're gonna finish this up and then we gotta go down there and feed that baby. I've been feeding that baby about every 30 minutes. And like I say, this is something that I feed them extra um, throughout the day is this is, it's, I need to get some more water and put in there, but just some oats mixed with some B12 and some a little bit of chicken corn. Um, I meant to get some uh, sunflower seeds, but we'll try to get that the next go around at the store. How are y'all today, babies? Huh? Y'all doing good? I wish y'all lay lay them eggs, and uh, I need to put that tarp back on back there. Looks like some of it's tore off. I'm gonna get a bigger tarp, uh, zip tie. I may end up going to getting some dirt and then coming back here on this backside and putting dirt on the back because it's actually ripped, ripped the back out. I need to get with Dutch, keeping it Dutch and see how he actually had his pin because if I come in here and put that dirt down, that'll keep it from blowing out. But 
still it's going to have pressure coming this way. So we'll just have to see. Just one of those deals, just trying to figure things out as we go. And who knows, they may have a cover to go around that whole thing. Lock this up. Their feed's good, water's good, oyster shell's good, laying pellets good. They got their snack for the day. And they should be good for the rest of the evening. We got two eggs out of the day, so. All right, so we're just kind of doing our walk through with the animals here. And uh, these guys here have been locked up for about uh, a week now. So we're gonna go ahead and let them out and stroll the farm, see how they get along with everybody. Y'all gonna be good? Huh? Y'all gonna be good? I'm gonna leave your food in there though. All right. Come on out. Come on out. Yeah, come on out with the rest of them. Again, he's like, okay. Uh-oh, they're Jerry. Jerry's like, oh boy, I got a new friend on the market. There, there's the new guinea right there. Uh-oh. That's the new one. Whoa. Holy cow. Hey, guys. They're going to run him off. What are y'all so mean for? What are y'all so mean for? Huh? How in the world do they know that that's a New Guinea? In which I do believe Medina did tell me that is a male, so we'll watch them and see. It'd take you just a little bit, buddy, but hopefully, hopefully they let you in the flock. For some reason, they do not like that feller. But uh, I'm trying to find that little brown hen. There she is. We need to get her caught and put her in with the chocolates. Now that is one that we actually raised here on, on the farm. That is the only one. It was so hard to raise those guys, uh, especially if you're not properly set up, but we're getting there now. We're just about there. So we're gonna go up here and get the side by side. We're gonna go get a net. We're gonna go catch her. Getting the day started. I keep on hearing something. Getting the day started. These things are always circling around, but um, we're, we're going through and going through all the, the babies just like we do every morning. It's just a routine uh, deal we do. And um, I was looking at the cameras this morning. We got really, really lucky that the coyote didn't come up here, but we got him on two of our cameras. Two different sets, like yeah. not even close to each other. He didn't even, he didn't even try to go for the, the bait, but that is Bobcat uh, bait that uh, Layton's got out. I did order him some coyote bait and lure, and um, we're gonna set that out and try to catch him because he come through two different sets, like I say, and uh, I'll get that footage and show y'all, put it in right about now. It doesn't seem like it's been that long ago since we got feed, but maybe, I don't know. We're gonna look at the date because I don't think this load of feed actually lasted this as long as that last one. And um, I know, first off, we was feeding it um, kind of like we was feeding the uh, four-way. Uh, we was giving them three big old uh, scoops or three big buckets which uh, had a lot of y'all say, hey, there's more protein into that, which makes sense. So we kind of backed off and uh, we started giving them one, um, one five gallon bucket per each pen. But I don't know, we're gonna do some um, checking on the way up there and look at our, look at our screenshots and stuff to see if, um, how long ago it was. Cause I know the last one kind of um, lasted us almost three months. So 
So what we're going to do is go ahead and uh, we we'll need to unload actually the shavings. I don't know. We'll unload the shavings down here and then we're going to load up the feeder and then we're going to head to town. Um, go through all the babies. We probably, we'll go through all the babies and stuff real quick, make sure none of them's in distress or anything like that because we did have a couple new, uh, uh, well, a couple uh, mamas that are getting pretty close. So we're gonna unload this and then we'll go there and check that out before we go to town. It seems like we go through a lot of this shavings, but it was cold. It was cold to keep them cold or keep them warm. Our chickens, though, um, we're putting the shavings in there, just kind of give them some bedding and kind of make them sc scratch around on the feed. Let's just leave that feed in here right now. Um, so what I want to do up here at the top, and I know I've talked about it in videos before, I want to get kind of a, a, a building up there. Here's the, I'm not going to build it. I'm not no carpenter. I went through that with this one and I don't want to go back through that anymore. So we also have uh, the minerals. Um, we, we started putting minerals out for the goats and um, especially the mamas. We gave the other ones minerals as well. But right now we're just, you know, taking the mamas need some extra, extra love and care. Your McDonald's. She doesn't look as big right now though than she has. Yeah. So <clears throat> we look at the mamas, but we, we also look at the, the goats because everything's actually ear tagged. And uh, we we'll just kind of go through them and make sure everybody's got an ear tag. Yep. Yeah, y'all get to eat here in just a minute. Who's all hanging out in here? There's four of them. Unless there's a couple. There may be a couple. I bet in you here. there's a, a couple down in here. Let's see. Who is it? Who is it? Oh, we're wrong. It's what are you nice. doing, Cinnamon? It's nice now. <laughs> nice outside. Hey, oh. How are you? Huh? You're the next one to the farm. Well, how are you doing, buddy? You want to say hi? You That's the one that everybody was wondering about. The one that was super weak. Yes. It's, I'd say it's empty, but we're going to go fill, fill it up. And All right, guys, we're getting some feed, and uh, we're going to go with a different top this go around. This is going to be 530 seconds. It's a lot smaller than the other, so. We'll fill it up, see how long this one lasts. The other one didn't last very long, about six, seven weeks, so. As I'm letting it down, I don't know if you can see that back there. It's bringing this all the way down so I get to the spot we can uh, put the pin in there. Can you put the pin in there yet? No, nope, you could earlier. You want the hole underneath? Yep. Okay, keep going. I don't see it yet. These are the cubes we were feeding, and um, I'll show you what these are like. a lot smaller they're, they're actually 14% uh, 
and um, they've got basically the same stuff in it. Um, as it, he was trying to tell me a little bit about it, but I think with the animals we have, with, we got so many baby goats, the baby goats can't eat these very well. And we there is another uh, uh, bag of, of feed that we will eventually feed the baby goats once we start winging them for mom. And what we'll do there was we'll build a pen with a small gap in it that allow all the baby goats to go in there and eat so the big ones can. All right, so I need over high. You stand right there. Y'all gonna get stuck. You don't stop that. All right, now get out. Yeah, that's what I thought. Dad's gonna have to get you unstuck. Oh, there you go. Oh, don't get in here. Don't get in here. Oh, no wonder. Turn that head. Come on, follow dead. Look, there's not very many in there. Get this over there to him. Look at chicken. Gonna get hung up, you better stop it. Hey, she done jumped out. She'll be wanting back here in in a minute. Right, I know where you're going. <laughs> yeah, because these little feeders were good at the very beginning when they we only had a few goats and they were a lot smaller goats. Now they're a lot bigger and yeah. Now we have those couple of buckets in there too. I mean, it's all the same pin, but we have the two buckets. So that'll let, um, I'll go feed the dog. Baby stuck underneath. Well, 
you do them, I'll go ahead and get Carly over here. Hey, Carly. I love these buttons. All right, it says 9,500. Y'all kids all happy? Yeah. We're 500 away, 500 away. All right, guys, I said I was closing out this video. I'm going to go ahead and put this in here before I close it out. As we are creeping up on 100,000 subscribers, um, it's a great feeling. I will say that it's crazy how it got all the way to 100 and then drop 100, come back 100, it's back and forth, but hey, I'm just so excited that we're to this point, um, getting ready to celebrate. We tried it last night, but it slowed down tremendously. Um, Leighton and all the families on their way home from uh, practice. So we will probably be going live and celebrating tonight, hopefully. We're going to hit it tonight. But anyways, thank y'all so much for y'all's love and support. All right, guys, so this is super exciting. We're actually live right now. Oh, we. We are going to be live to hit 100,000 well, subscribers. We're super excited about it. And wait, wait. We need eight, eight more. more. Eight more, huh? <laughs> so, Can we get there? Yeah, eight more, and then we're there. Come on, people, subscribe. So subscribe. it's, it's pretty cool. Wait, and then we get a play button. I mean, a black silver play button. Yeah. You get, no, it, it'll probably <laughs> take a little while to get here. But, guys, this is what it's all about. And, um, you know, we couldn't have done this without all of us. This is a whole group family uh, deal. And um, it's amazing. Uh oh, four more. Four more. Uh, Come on, no. go, down. go down, down. Oh, the Eldridge fam was live. They said sending anyone we can over from our live. Oh. I want to see this 100,000. I'm sorry I didn't see y'all's live. Yeah, we well, I... Yes! Three, 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 three more. Hurry, 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 everybody get chairs. Yeah, <laughs> three more, and we're going to hit 100. Oh, four more, four more, four more. Oh, whoa, three. we're going the wrong direction. Five more, five more. Five more. Go up. Come on, go up. One more, one more. Hey, there's always gonna be that one guy that's just gonna play it. Just gonna yeah. subscribe and then unsubscribe. Subscribe, <laughs> unsubscribe. Uh oh. There's probably someone in the live being like, I want to see him get excited. <laughs> uh oh, there it is, guys. <laughs> Somebody, I wish I knew how to screen record my computer. Oh my, uh, oh my gosh. We are at nine, 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 nine. There it is, guys. 100,000 subscribers. Look at that, guys. 101. That is absolutely amazing. Um, wow. What a great feeling it is. Huh? It can go down. We've already hit 100,000, so it's official. Um, <laughs> there we go. You want to see their reactions instead? What she is saying. Yeah, I could have done that earlier, but 